you're probably not one dieting phase or like one fitness phase away from like your ultimate physique or your dream physique. It's going to take time and it's likely going to take bringing calories up, bringing calories down maintenance phases that, but there are cycles to this. And it's not that you're going to need to be doing them forever and ever and ever, but it's that one dieting phase is probably not the end all be all to your health and fitness journey. I, I like to, I like to say that very frequently. Um, and I think that it also helps to realize that the people that we are looking at, especially the ones who, to be quite honest, are often preaching like reverse dieting and this being the way they have already gone through these cycles mm -hmm. 15 times over yeah. for 10 to 15 years, right? So yeah, it might look easier for these professionals or for these yep. fitness people on social media that you're seeing because they've gone through it so many times already. Um, and again, that's where the whole like flashiness of it gets me a little bit because it's catchy. It, it reels people in, which again, is not necessarily a bad thing. Cause at the end of the day, we end up helping people, but yes. um, the promise of reverse dieting as this way to bypass maintenance or speed up your metabolism mm -hmm. and lose fat doing so it's kind of like, that's, it's not going to do that. Yeah. What is going to do that? What is going to speed up your metabolism and allow you to maintain a lower body fat percentages going through these cycles for 10 to 15 years. Yeah.